night, everybody. Good night. How are you guys? Oh my goodness, Wilfredo. What a nice picture do you might have today. Oh. Yeah. Isn't it amazing? Yeah. Hi, how are you? Hi, and you? Pretty good. Is that the picture that you took when you graduated from the university? Or when you got <laughs> married? I don't know. No, no, no. Good you job. Know? Oh, for your job. Is that yeah, the batch? <laughs> the batch one, no? Uh, yeah. This, that, exactly. That's the batch? Hey, you know what I'm asking you? Because when you're in the batch, they had to say, hey, hey, don't put like your face like this or your face like this. No, you have to <laughs> sit straight, okay? You had a, like a white background. So it's like, oh my God. And you're looking your, yeah. your, your, your side, right? So you can, you can be much better and hands are pretty, but now they just click and then that's it. Go next one. <laughs> yeah, that's your badge. Hey, is is it was this year or how long ago? Uh, three years. Three, three years, years ago? ago. Oh my goodness, yeah. that was a long time ago, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, how old are you by then? Sorry? How old were you? How old were you by then? Uh. Oh, okay. I, I think you do I'm not okay. do don't do not understand the question, right? How old were you by then? What was your age when they took the picture? Uh 41. <gasps> 41. So now you're 44. No. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> really? You don't look like really? that's good. Thank you. Yeah, well, but I want to see your live face, not a picture. Come on. <laughs> okay. Yeah, and the reason why, uh, fine. yeah, <laughs> very good. And I like the color of your wall because that color is, it shows happiness. Happiness and at the same okay. time, calm space. You know what? I love that color. Actually, part of my uh, room that I'm right now is the same color because I love that color. That is a happy <laughs> color, an energy color. Yes, I like it a lot. Very good. Okay, guys, how you feel? This is our last day. Isn't it amazing? Yeah, right? Isn't it amazing? Yeah. Are you happy? Yes, finally. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yes, I know. I knew it. I knew it. And thank you for being so sincere, Wilfredo. <laughs> Thanks, God, we're, not, we're going to rest from her, okay? Uh huh. Nah, I'm just kidding, Wilfredo. Come on, I'm just kidding. Wilfredo is so like, oh my God. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> All right, guys, before we continue, we start, I just want to ask you if you do have any questions or any problems regarding the platform exercises that you would like to double check right now. Yeah? No. Yeah. Um, okay, no. Take a piece of cake, you know. Mm -hmm. I have a problem. Wh what problem do you might have, Ricardo? And in what section? Uh, number four and number five. Okay, number four and number five. What's the problem that you have? Uh, let me see the number number five. Um, I didn't see wait a number minute. six numbers number six all right let me go ahead and check section number five yeah. five point three you said okay uh, yeah 12 15 in front of the cafeteria jerry to meet at oh meet you're us. talking about present continuous and be going to is that the one you're talking about mm, no it's uh you said 5.3. Five, let me see, let me see. Yeah. All right. Take it, check it. No, yeah, 5.9, so. knowledge check. Ah, uh, 5.9, okay, that's what I want to know. Can you help me? <laughs> of course, but I'm not going to give you the answer. Number six. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so 5.9, all right. All right, I know what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. The knowledge check. Okay. The knowledge check. Mm -hmm. Numbers. Uh, I guess. Uh, 
Let me try to open it right now. Let me try to open okay, it. Okay, okay. okay, so right now it's opening. Here you go. Oh, okay, I know what it is. Okay. Uh-huh. I like it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Hey, but do you remember that that is exactly what we have seen yesterday? Yesterday, yes, yes. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It's about ask and tell. Okay. Mm -hmm. yes. So you you have to re you have to remember what I sent it to you yesterday, guys, about ask and tell. For example, do you, you have to remember that uh, if you're using um a statement, which one you're going to use, tell or ask, guys? What do you think? Tell. Tell exactly, and also you can use ask. either that or you don't ask. use it, right? Okay. Yeah. That is one. Uh, but also, guys, do you have to remember that um, also yesterday we saw that we can also use please, we can also use could, and we can also use would, right? Right. Uh-huh. But do you remember that if we use would, for example, uh, we put or could, we, we put the subject, it could be you, he, her, whatever, Armando, you can put the name, okay, of the person. You use it before the word tell or you use it after the word tell? Mm -hmm. After. Uh-huh. For example, you said, could you tell her? No, you, you don't you say, tell could her? you help her tell, okay. right? Or you can also say, could you tell that her, no, could you tell her okay. that? Uh -huh. So as long as you follow the structure, you will be able to, to, uh, to do but the, it. But the use of that is optional. Yes, I it's guess. optional, yes. Okay. And also, if it's a question, you don't have to forget the question mark at the end, right? In this, in this number, it's missing, question uh, yeah. mark. Yeah, but if it doesn't matter if it's missing, you need to put it. <laughs> yes, yes, this exercise, guys, is uh, it helps you think, okay? Because maybe sometimes there will be one word that is uh, spelled wrong, but it doesn't mean that you're going to write it like that way. You need to write it in the correct way. Okay. Yes, exactly. Uh, and also, guys, remember that if you're going to, for example, use could or would, you need to put the C as in capitalized, right? And the W capitalized because you are beginning a question. You are beginning a sentence. So you need to put in capitalized. If you put it everything correctly, but the C is in lower cases or W is lower cases, it's going to give you wrong. It will be wrong because of that. Mm -hmm. Yes, so I, those are like, a, maybe we can think that there's like a little things, but they are big things. Talking about grammarly and punctuation. Mm -hmm. So basically that, that, is, that is exactly what you have to do in that section, eh, Ricardito. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I check it. Mm -hmm. you yeah, you can check it. Okay, let me, for example, uh, give you one example really quickly. Let me check. I think, let me check this one really quickly. Okay, I need to click on the other one because I was with the other group. So I'm sorry for that. Okay, for example, in the one that said, um, could you tell Joel? Okay, that one. You can either uh, write, could you tell Joel that the movie is at seven or could you tell Joel that the movie is at seven? Okay, you can, you have it here. So I send it to you right now. Okay. okay, okay so okay. basically you need to follow that. And also guys, I'm, I want you, I want everybody right now to do it. Okay, we're going to not do it, right? But at the same time, I will help you with the final exam. Did you guys finish the final exam already? Raise your hand who had finished. Marlon, Georgie, mm -hmm. and Erica. Yes, Georgie. In, in, this, in this question, uh, I have a problem in the platform. In the platform, no, which one? Uh -huh. No, in ask Jerry, no point is correct. 
Ah, is, ask Jerry. Okay, it, it is the same section of uh, Ricardo? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Okay. Yeah. The number six is sin punto, teacher. Let me check. Let me check number six. six. I try every day and... Ah. ah, yes. You need to say, please ask Jerry to meet us in front of the cafeteria at 12.15. Do you have it like that way? It's like this. But remember that you need to put it in capitalized P, right? You need to put a P capitalized. Because if you do not put P capitalized, it's going to be wrong. Pusiste con P mayúscula? Yeah? Yeah. Lo pusiste con punto al final? No lleva, right? Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ven? Uh, maybe, maybe it's a mistake. Yeah, so you need to double check also, for example, if there's spaces between words and all the stuff, because wow. all of that, yes, all of that. Yes. Because the, the purpose of the, of the exercise, guys, is not just to have a grade. Like, yeah, I passed, right? I got eight, I got nine. No, 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 no. The purpose of the, of the exercises, of each part of the platform exercises, is that you practice. That you practice listening, reading, or writing the topics that you have seen during the class. And also, it's like an extra activity. And also, the purpose is that you learned. Okay. Yeah, you learned. And maybe mm -hmm. they will have a headache, right? Like, oh, my God, I give up, you said. I give up. I try a thousand times, and no way. No. But it will help you to write grammarly correctly. So that's why. That's why. You said, yeah, I did it, everything. I put everything in order, but what's going on? It's because maybe you're, you're putting too many spaces between words. Maybe you're missing a dot. Maybe you're missing a comma. Maybe you're putting the wrong apostrophe. Maybe you're not using capital letter. It could be many reasons. And they will give you the good answer once you finish it and put it in the right way. That's why, guys. Uh, okay, so if I under, I, may I have answered your question, Ricardito? Yeah, yes, I, I... I, I, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Okay, now, guys, I want. I know that some of you have already finished that, but some of you have not, and it will be like a refresh for you guys. But I want to double check really quickly, and then we are going to continue with our topics for today. Uh, really quickly, the final exam for me it's really important to double check it because I want that everybody will be in the same pace. Okay, bear with me for a couple of minutes. Let me share right now my screen. You said, Erika, you have finished, right? Georgie as well, and also Marlon, and also Wilfredo. But we're missing Hermes, Flora, Cecilia, Eden Nilsson, Maria Luisa, Ricardo, and Patricia. Georgie, do you know is by any chance your husband has finished the platform? Yes, yeah, he finished. Oh my goodness, congratulations. Okay, very good. Okay, so it's going to be really quick, guys, just to help the rest of the guys to also ex see exactly what they need to do. But my best recommendation all the time, guys, for the final exam, that um, try to read the instructions. Read it. They are in Spanish and in English, right? So they're both languages. Also, guys, try to read the questions and the possible answers, especially in the listening part. Because when you do that, you will have exactly in your mind what is the information that you need to focus on, okay? And it will be easier for you to have a better uh, a great, uh, score in this case. Bear with me. Let me go really quickly with each of them. And let me share right now my screen. Uh, you can stop me, okay? You can stop me if you have any questions. That's okay for me. I'm not, I'm not mad about that. So bear with me for a moment. Let me check. Mm -hmm. There you go. Let me share right now my computer. Okay, are you able to see my computer, guys? Yes, right. Okay, the first part is the A part, which is the listening part. We have one, two, three. Okay, we have excuses and invitations. Okay, so we have West invitation and West excuse. Read an invitation and read excuses. So basically, you just need to read who is the person and what is the possible answer for each of them. And then after that, guys, listen. 
but listen, not uh, to try to uh, check the answer. Just listen without reading the, the answers. And the second time, you read and you listen. ¿Me entienden? Am I, am I yeah. make myself clear? Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Okay, the second yeah. section. Uh, Ricardito, is that okay? Yeah, that's okay. Okay. Now we need to put the words in the correct order. Okay, this is, you know how it works, right? Okay. Yeah. Guys, this is really important. Okay, complete the conversation. Use the correct form of the verse. Remember, guys, that we saw present continuous and be going to? Aquí es donde va a usar eso, okay? Aquí es donde lo va a usar. You have the verb and the words here. Well, only two verbs in this case, right? Plan and do. One and a stay. Go and, go and do. Remember, guys, que no me vaya a usar primero el do y después el planning. Usted tiene que usar el primer verbo que aparezca ahí. Y también el segundo, pero lo tiene que saber cómo usarlo y en qué forma y en qué orden. Okay? Pero here, guys, basically it's present continuous and be going to. Mm. Yes, no. Maria Luisa, right? Or Patty? I have a doubt. I have a doubt, okay. That in this part, the number three. Mm -hmm. uh, let me see. Number three. Mm -hmm. And number, no, number two. Mm -hmm. Literal B. Okay, literal B, okay, yeah. Uh, number three, literal B. Okay, so number two and number three. Uh, you're, are you trying to do it and it's not working? Yes, and the others is correct, but okay. this no. Okay, maybe because you are using the, you're putting the ing form in the wrong verb. Maybe there are spaces. No, I try, but no. Mm -hmm. Okay, no problem. Okay, but this is present continuous. I be going to. I will. I will double check right now. To, uh, what is good or what is not good and then I will help you okay individually because I'm not going to give you the answers uh -huh. but yes don't worry but but I know so you said a uh, section two you said 2b and 3b is that right You're right yes okay, okay. Right. 2b and 3b okay I will double check that in a moment and I will help you individually in this guys you need to correct the, you need to check the correct uh, word that it fits the end of the sentence. For example, there are a lot of beautiful trees in this, and then you can check sea, forest, waterfall, yeah. Do you remember that we saw geography vocabulary? Do you remember that? Yes, right? We, we saw lake, mountains, river. So basically, mm -hmm. this is what you have to do. And these guys, in the second part, you need to select the correct way to use the verb. For example, Please tell Mary there's a school party on Sunday or you need to say, please, to tell Mary. Which one is the correct one? You need to think about it. I'm not going to give you the answer. Okay, guys, in the section D, you will need to use would, will, I'd, or I'll, okay? Basically, those model verbs. Do you remember that we saw that as well? The model verbs would and will, do you remember that? You need to, uh, to use it here. And here, guys, in letter E, uh, basically is what we have seen yesterday about requests. Do you remember that we saw ask and tell and also we could and would? Yes. And, okay. And finally, this is an article that my best recommendation will be that check the questions, the possible answers, and once you have this information in your mind, then you start reading, okay? But before you read, guys, try to search or highlight or underline the words that you don't know what does it mean. Las que usted no sepa qué significa, antes de empezar a leer, subrayelas. Y búsquelas en el diccionario. Cuando usted ya tenga esto, todo esto en la mente, y tenga las la, la, el significado de las palabras que usted no entendía, hoy sí se pone a leer. Y ya va a ver que lo va a entender. ¿Ok? <coughs> any questions, any doubts besides the one that you let me know that I, ya se la voy a responder en un ratito. <laughs> Por lo menos le puede dar una idea, no le voy a dar el answer, right? Uh -huh. 
Y no, le, y no le pregunte a Marlon ni a Georgie ni a Wilfredo. Ok. No way, no way. Ok. Don't worry, I will, I will help you, ok. No, tampoco a Erika, por favor. Entonces, más o menos eso es lo que tienen que hacer. Hey, felicíteme por mi español. Come on. Nadie me felicita por mi español. Ah, and thank you, Wilfredo. Se suena raro, yo sé, pero es que no hablo español mucho. Thank you, Ricardo. Hasta siento raro el español a veces, pero bueno. Así es mi vida. Beautiful, you know, the Spanish. ¿Es bonito? Ah, muchas gracias. Oh. Ya me, ya me puso roja, pero no se puede ver acá. No, verdad, no, no, no se puede ver. No, no. Es, es, el, es el reflejo de la, de la cámara, you know. Mm -mm. ¿Sabe? A veces me pasa que, ¿sabe? Yo hay cosas que, ¿cómo le podría decir? Hablo español, pero no se me viene la palabra en español, aunque yo la sepa. Entonces, lo primero que sale de mi boca es la palabra en inglés o la palabra en francés. Por ejemplo, um, yo le digo, pásame este backpack que está por ahí. Backpack? Oh, esa mochila, right? Y si estuviera en Costa Rica, ese bulto. <ríe> right? Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Imagine. O oh, por ejemplo, um, ¿Qué te pasó? ¿Por qué veniste tarde? Es que vieras que es el traffic que you cannot imagine. Traffic. It was a hard traffic. Es tráfico duro. Pero si usted está en Costa Rica, usted hubiera dicho, la presa que me encontré. La presa. La presa es el traffic. ¿Sí? Oh, yeah. Y es la presa también que se mete a la, a, a la cárcel, al jail. Imagínense. Depends of the context. Sí. Entonces, imagínense. Es difícil, ¿verdad? Dicho, ¿Cómo se dice? Trabazón, exacto. <risa> Trabazón. Eh, eh, hay una palabra en, ing en inglés que se usa, como por ejemplo, cuando me quedé trabado, así que tú llegaste y que no se movía, pero ni un mosquito enfrente de ti, ni atrás, ni de un lado ni al otro, se dice cough in a rush. Cough in a rush es que estabas, te trabaste, te, en la, estuviste en la trabazón, te topaste con la trabazón. <risa> Cough in a rush. Eso, eso es una expresión. I was, I was cough in a rush. Okay? Ya se, se lo voy a mandar después. Es una expresión. Cuando usted dice, estoy atascado. ¿Sí? Estoy atascado y no se mueve, pero ni un alma, dice uno. I was cough in a rush. Uh -huh. A vuelta de rueda. A vuelta de rueda. Exactly. Oh, my goodness. Qué raro suena eso. A vuelta de rueda. Sí. No de llanto. All right. I may apologize. Ay, ay. No, viera que, que día que fue una vez. Oh, sí. Eh, una vez yo estaba prácticamente, no hablando inglés, hablando francés. Desde las seis de la mañana hasta las cinco y media de la tarde. Y uh, una vez llegó mi esposo a traerme um, y estábamos almorzando. Y yo sabía, estábamos en la Plaza Merliot, yo sabía que las personas estaban hablando español. Pero usted cree que les entendía qué estaban diciendo. No entendía. Porque mi cerebro, mi cerebro para mí estaban hablando en francés. Y algo así sonaban para mí. Porque imagínense estar hablando francés de las 6 de la mañana. Uf, es increíble. O está hablando los tres idiomas al mismo tiempo también. Es complicado. Uh -huh. Pero es bien chido. <ríe> sí, es bien chido. Hoy tengo, quiero ver, desde marzo, que no hablo francés como, como estaba hablando en francés, porque estoy en otro lugar ahorita, pero me gusta. Tengo que terminarlo. That's, that's a goal that I have to reach. Por lo menos, ya saben una, una, una frase en francés. ¿Cómo se dice Big Duncan en francés? ¿Se recuerdan? Big Duncan. Ajá, ¿cómo fue, Georgie? Ajá. Ah, más o menos. Solo te acuerdas del tren, ¿verdad? Shoo, shoo, right? Ok. Pero acuérdate que si es una chica, es la chuchu de la clase. Y si es un chico, es 
le chouchou de la classe, no le, le. Porque le, le está diciendo le, -E, que es para masculino. Pero si tú dices le, está diciendo le, -E s, que está diciendo plural. Sí, o sea que la pronunciación es bien importante. Le chouchou de la classe, masculino. La chouchou de la classe, femenino. Feminin, masculin. Uh -huh. Teacher, ¿cuál es el número que odian decir en francés? ¿Cómo? ¿Cuál es el número que odian decir en francés? Hay un número que dice mucho y es por cortito. No sé si es 80 y algo, no sé, por ahí. Ah, ah eh, eh, pero 80 es eh, eh, 80. No, bueno, pero hay un número que se dice toda una frase y solo es como un par de numeritos. De... Ah, 90. 90. No, 98. Pero... 98 es 98. No, no, me pregunto y después pasas la bola en WhatsApp, ¿ok? Because it's going to be the last, the last, the last day that we're going to see each other, guys. So I'm so happy. I'm happy, but at the same time I'm sad. Because I don't know if I'm going to be with you or it's going to be a new teacher. That's okay. But whatever it is. I'm so happy and I'm so grateful to meet you and to share with you all this one month. One month, but really fast, right? Really, really fast. And if I'm going to continue with you, that would be amazing. And if not, well, I wish you the best, of course. The best, the best, the best. Cool. We will continue learning a lot. Uh, today, guys, um, we will continue practicing. Today, what I'm going to send it to you is a writing practice. A writing practice, but first, uh, do you remember that we saw yesterday ask and tell, right? We saw that, okay. So do me a favor. I will give you one minute. Think about a message, a message that you would like to give to three, to three uh, classmates, pero, But, no se lo va a dar a esa persona. Usted se lo va a mandar a alguien más. Por ejemplo, póngale un ejemplo. Yo le mando el mensaje a Ricardo. Y le digo, Ricardo, en el chat, right? Private one. ¿Le puedes decir a Wilfredo que se ponga un calcetín rojo en la cabeza? Es un ejemplo. ¿Sí? Eh, tienen, que ser tienen que ser mensajes locos, pero no tanto, ¿eh? Y tampoco con o sin ofender a nadie, ¿ok? De, es de eso se trata. O por ejemplo, le digo a Ricardo, Ricardo, dile, dile a Erika que se pinta el bigote. Right? Like that. Un ejemplo. O le digo, um, Ricardo, dile a Hermes que se tiña el cabello de rojo. Like that, right? ¿Me entiendes? Vamos a practicar ask and tell, ¿ok? Entonces, necesito que cada uno escriba en inglés, of course, right? Uh, tres mensajes, ¿ok? Using, eh, en este caso, statements, porque vamos a usar tell, ¿sí? Vamos a usar tell ahorita, no ask, tell. You can use it with that or without it, ¿ok? You can use it with please, o you can use it with would, o you can use it with could. ¿Se recuerdan? Please es un statement y could y would es una question, ¿sí? Entonces, le voy a dar un minuto y después eh, le voy a decir a alguien que mande el mensaje privado en el chat a la persona y cuando le llegue esa persona... Ah, no, no, no. Ya después voy... No, espérense, todavía no les doy las instructions. Solo escríbanlo, ¿ok? And when you finish, I'll be right back. No sé, no sé cómo es el lapicero, Marlon. I'm just kidding. All right, I will give you one minute, guys. It's enough. Un mensaje. ¿Un Three messages. Tres mensajes, Linda. Three messages. Okay. With tell.
I'm here if you need to ask any question, okay? Guys, and when you send the message, for example, please, usted tiene que usar el nombre del classmate que usted quiere que le dé el recado a la otra persona. Por ejemplo, Georgie, si tú dices, please, Wilfredo, tell Ricardo, o tell Georgie, o tell Hermes, o tell Marlon, ¿ok? Pero tiene que usar un nombre de la persona que usted quiere que lea los mensajes que usted escribió. ¿Me entiende? After, please, or, or before, please? No, please, please, eh, Ricardo, tell, Wilfredo, ah. that, ajá, ¿me entiende? Ciento catorce, seis, setenta y uno. Ok. Ok. <laughs> I'm just teasing you. Okay, one more minute. Or did you finish, guys? Yes? Okay, cool. All right. Marlon. Do me a favor. Okay, who, who are you going to send, to send the message? Para que los lea. ¿A quién le vas a pedir que lea los mensajes? We cannot hear you, sorry. Maybe no finish. <laughs> I know, no. <laughs> yeah, he has finished already. But I think you have yourself on mute. Nope. You can use maybe the computer audio. That might work. There you go. No. Oh, no, yeah, no, yeah, no. yeah, yeah, yeah. No. That's good. Yes. Yeah. Okay, to Ricardo. Okay, so do me a favor. Yep. Uh, try to type privately into the chat and send it directly to Ricardo, okay? Send it to him right uh, now. Three sentences or just one? No, three of them. Okay. And Ricardo, you need to write it, uh, you need to read it one by one, okay? Solo dilo, solo léelo. Y le tienes que decir a la persona. Por ejemplo, Rick Marlon te va a mandar los tres mensajes, right? Y ahí dice, please tell Erika to eh, put some makeup. Un ejemplo, ¿verdad? Un ejemplo. Entonces le, tú le dices, Erika, put some makeup. ¿Sí? ¿Me entiendes lo que vas a hacer? Un ejemplo. Los tres mensajes van a ir dirigidos a una sola persona. No, y different, el... different. O sea, a una sola persona, sí, pero ese mensaje va a hablar de diferentes compañeros de clase, right? Oh. Uh -huh. ¿Ya lo mandaste? 
I write the first. I'm writing the first one. Okay. Ricardito, you need to be yes. careful. Give me a second. Pay attention, Carlitos. Ricardito. There is the first one. Okay, Ricardito, you receive it? We cannot hear you, Ricardito. Sorry. We cannot hear you. Okay. 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 And now? Oh, yes, we can hear you. Me? Yes, yes, we do. Okay. okay. This, uh, yeah, ¿quién va this, message, message? this message is, is in, in chat who? or Zoom. Uh -huh. Chat. Yes, Zoom oh, okay. chat, yes. Soon shot. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me see Marlon. <clears throat> Marlon. Okay. Uh, you can see it. I read. Ricardo. There is I read. Would you ask the teacher? Aha, uh -huh. you can, you have to ask me. Sí? Me tienes que no me no tienes que leerlo para ti y después tú me lo dices en tercera persona. Teacher. Okay, lo que lo que Marlon okay. te mande a decir. Teacher, uh -huh. no, 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 no. I don't know. Is it about me? <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> Good job. Eh, Espero que no me hagan balear el pomponte ni a pomponte, okay? Teacher. Yes. Could you remove the her Zoom background? Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, as you please, and as you wish, I'm going to remove it. <laughs> you see? <laughs> there is the second one. But I changed it. What about this one? <laughs> what about this? No. What about this? Yeah. No, I'm not going to. <laughs> okay, I did it, <laughs> but only once. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, I didn't put it back, Marlon. Okay, <laughs> okay, the second sentence, okay. please. There is the second sentence, Ricardo. Okay, 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 Marlon. Let me see. Uh, we'll pray. <laughs> The basketball, the basketball is a, is a boring uh, The basket, that the basketball is a boring sport. Uh -huh. Can you hear me, Wilfredo? No, I can hear you. I don't know, Wilfredo. No, uh, no, no. No? Please repeat, Ricardo. Please repeat, Ricardo. Um, Wilfredo. That the basketball is a boring sport. Ah, okay. Te está diciendo que el basketball is a boring sport. <laughs> what What is boring? Basketball. Basketball. <laughs> Do you practice? Yes, sir. Very good. Yeah. Excellent. Not too bad. Okay, and the, and the last one, the last message for who? There is the third message. Okay, Ricardo. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. it's, a, it's a fun. Ah, no. <laughs> Hopefully it's not about me. <laughs> no. Oh, okay, no. you've. Okay, no, I'm just saying. I was Hermes the first victim. Change, Hermes, to change your hairstyle. Hair or his style? Hermes. Uh huh. Hermes. Okay. Yes. Uh huh. Dilo uh, otra vez. Dilo otra vez. A Hermes to change, to change his her style. Here, his. Porque acuérdate que es chico, no chica. His. Oops. Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. okay. Very good. Her Hermes, change your style. Sí, de un solo. ¿Te acuerdas? Hermes, change your style. Ah, yes. Okay. directamente a él. El mensaje es diferente. Know, sí. Very good. Excellent. Okay. okay. Uh, Georgie. Excellent job, Ricardo. Georgie, now send your message to Erika, please. 
<laughs> that would be so much fun. I, I sent I sent to Wilfredo, teacher. Oh, to Wilfredo. Oh my God. Oh, okay. Okay. Who's going to be the first victim? No, the first participant. I don't know. Very good, Marlon. Excellent job. Excellent job, guys. Okay. okay. My turn. Uh huh. Me? Okay. okay. No. Victor. Ah, few of Victor. <laughs> Big. Victor, that's to put his Hello, glasses. sorry. It's uh, raining in my house. Uh. It's raining. Okay. Yes. Say it again, Wilfredo. Okay. Uh, Victor, that's to put his glasses. Ah, put, Victor, please put your glasses on. Ponte los lentes. Sorry. I don't, I don't listen. Um, sorry. Um, I, I, I live in the... The volume. Oh, the volume. Okay. Put your glasses on. Que te pongas los lentes. Yeah. Okay. Very good. Excellent. <laughs> All right. Second message, please. Erica, that's tomorrow dance salsa. Okay. O or today. <laughs> oh my god. Oof. That was so direct message. Okay. <laughs> what about number three? Marlon, that's I... light your painting. What? Marlon, that's I like your painting. Ah, she likes yeah. your painting. <laughs> oh right. The picture. Okay, very good. Excellent. Patty, what about you, Patty? Now it's your turn. ¿A quién se lo vas a mandar? Los tres mensajes me dijo que eran para la misma persona y que esa persona se los va a mandar a otras tres personas diferentes. Ajá, ¿a quién se lo mandaste okay. ya? A Abby. No, no los he mandado oh. todavía. Ok. Ok, this uh, first message is a uh, please, Abby, tell Erica to paint her Nice orange. Pero no me los digas. Tienes que mandárselo a la persona. Oh, ok, ok. Entonces lo voy a mandar. Ok, cuando lo mandes me avisas. Erika, oh, what about okay. you? Now, Erika, it's your turn. <laughs> ¿A quién le vas a mandar? Okay. A María Luisa, a Georgie, a Flor, okay. Hermes. I don't know. Ok. A uh, Hermes. A uh, Hermes. How? Ok, Hermes. Ya te van a llegar los mensajes. <laughs> That's great. Ooh. We cannot hear you, sorry. I'm waiting for the message. Oh, okay. Oh my God, this is really nice. Okay. Did you already send the messages, Patty? Oh, no, yet. Please. Yep. Yes. Please. Okay. Please. So, Please. After, after hear me, we're going to ask Abby. Okay. So don't worry about that. Yes. <laughs> this is going to be so much fun. Is it so much fun? Wilfredo, you're bad. <laughs> okay. Did you receive the first message already, Hermes? Okay. Okay. Please, Patty, please, Patty to take your hand. What? Patty, they're talking to you. What? Repeat, please. Uh -huh, repeat, okay. Please, Patty, to take your head. Take your head? Oh, oh. oh grab your Give head. Grab, okay. Toque la cabeza, touch your head. Now, I yeah. take my hair. Okay, we cannot see you, but that's okay. We're going to use our imagination, right? <laughs> okay, imagination. You see, guys. I write the message. <laughs> like, <laughs> okay, very good. Second I one. I very slowly write. <laughs> okay, that's okay. Take your time. <laughs> no rush. All right. Hermes, second message, please, if you don't mind. Georgina, touch your phone. Touch your phone, Georgie. I don't know. Touch your phone. 
Otra vez, touch your phone. There you go, very good, excellent. And number three, Hermes. <laughs> Teacher, please to sing. What? To sing a song. Oh, to sing a song. <coughs> to sing a song. <laughs> oh, okay, let me check. In, his, in Spanish, in English, in French, I don't know. Please. Uh, uh, in French. A romantic song. Okay, oh my goodness, a romantic song. I'm not a good singer, by the way. Uh, no, we can say pompon tenia pompon ten, right? <laughs> yeah, that was <sounds> good. <laughs> I, those that remember my uh, my childhood, he said, I think, I think it's like, pompon tenia pompon ten, ay viene su marinero, right? Con ese bonito traje que parece carnicero, right? I'll go see. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> oh my God. Well, I did my best. <laughs> that was nice. <laughs> Thank you, Hermes. <laughs> Thank you, Alfredo. Oh my God. I'm swearing like a pig right now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Very good. Patty. Okay. We're going to listen to Abigail already. Thank you, Hermes. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, Abby, we listen to you. Um, Patty, <laughs> uh, will you should uh, take the <laughs> uh, take the TV? <laughs> take the TV or turn the TV? <laughs> ok, pero Patty te mandó a ti, ¿verdad? Sent yes, I sent three Neces messages. Ajá, necesito que digas los messages de Patty, Abby. No los tengo. Oh, she said I sent. En el chat de Zoom. Take a look oh. at that. That's the reason why. <laughs> ha, 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 ha. Um, I sent you, Abby. Yes, so double check on that one. And then Ricardo, where are you? You found it, Abby? Yes. Okay, so uh, read it for us, please. Please, Abby, tell Erica to paint her nails orange. Oh my God, you need to paint your nails in <laughs> orange color. <laughs> Uh, no, those are natural. <laughs> All right, very good, excellent. Number two, please, Abby. Please, Abby, could you tell Georgie that we'll for her a day cemetery at uh twenty <laughs> twelve. Oh, well, again, 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 please, because she's Georgie's like what. <laughs> Okay, okay, all right, again, Abby. <laughs> Please, um, this. Mm -hmm. Yes, Georgie, Georgie's uh, message, please. Okay. Please, Abby, could you tell Georgie that we'll for her at the cemetery at 12? Very good. Okay, pero cuando tú dices, please tell, no, ella te está diciendo eso a ti. Tú lo tienes que decir a ella en tercera persona. You can say, Georgie, uh, okay. Georgie, and then you said the message. Georgie. <laughs> Patty said. Okay. Georgie, Patty tell that will for you at cemetery at 12. You, did you understand, Georgie? Yeah? Dijo Patty que te ven en el cementerio a las 12. Qué miedo. That's creepy. That's creepy. Oh my God. That's not creepy. Okay, okay. you're like niño ñañeras, right? Okay, very good. And the last one, Navi, you're so bad, Patty. Um, <laughs> no. <laughs> Herman. Hermes. Okay, Hermes. 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 Patty, tell to paint this hair red. <laughs> okay. Oh, you're mean, Patty. No. <laughs> she wants you to paint you to, to paint your hair as a red color. Red color. Que te pintes de rojo el cabello. Oh 
I sound like a Spanish girl. To her whole cabello. Oh my goodness. Push. That's why you're okay. Very good. Excellent. Okay. You are so mean, Papi. <laughs> no, <Okay>. you <laughs> say funny. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. But you took it so literally. Te lo tomaste muy en serio, right? Oh, just <laughs> All right, Ricardo, what about you? Who you're going to send your messages? ¿A quién le vas a mandar los mensajes? Uh, you have uh, Maria Luisa, uh, you have Flor, uh, Ceci, and Endo Nielsen. Maria Luisa. Maria Luisa. Uh, Hello, my beautiful girl. Hopefully, she's. Uh, I speak. I speak or, or no. You, you can. Or, you, yes. Right. You write. You you write it. You type it because she needs to say that. Uh, yeah, because because it's very difficult in yeah, smartphone. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay, so you can. You have to say it. Okay, say it, and Maria Lisa is going to. Okay, Maria Lisa, would you tell her? I'm sorry, sorry. <laughs> Would you tell Marlon stand up in the desk? Ah, okay, okay, Maria Luisa. Maria Luisa, dile, Marlon, párate, stand up. <laughs> dile. I, uh, on the desk. Yo estoy en pijama. <laughs> no, 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 solo dilo, solo dilo. No, no, no ah. te podemos ver, don't worry about that. Okay. Dile, Marlon, stand up on the desk. Dilo. Marlon, están on the desk. Okay. De but I can't use this. It's going to be broken. <laughs> eh, ya, ya, okay, guys. So just use your imagination that he's on the desk, okay? Like that. Like like a genius. Okay, yeah, exactly. Okay, okay. thank okay. you. Thank you, but stay there. Because you need to uh, also give two more messages. Second message, Ricardo. Please tell Erica speaks in Chinese. Maria Luisa, hi. You need hola, to say. Hola. You need to say. Uh, you need to let Erica to speak in Chinese. Erica, to speak in Chinese. Uh -huh. And where is Erica? She's gone. No, she's there. Erica, hi. You need to speak in Chinese at least one word. Uh, let me see. Arigato, maybe. Uh, no. Arigato is the Japanese. Japanese. Okay, I'm just kidding. Excuse me. <laughs> it's a, Excellent. Uh, Sayonara. I don't know. Sayonara is Japanese. Japanese as well. You see, I know more Japanese than Chinese. Okay. <laughs> Chinese is uh, hard. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Huh? Ni hao. Ni hao. <laughs> Ni hao. No. Uh, <laughs> Ni hao. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, that is Cantonese, but that's okay. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Okay. And finally, the last message, Ricardo. Uh, Patricia. Patricia. Mm -hmm. Hello. Mm -hmm. Patricia, uh, could you? Could you hear? Could you tell Hermes broken some glasses? Okay. Poor glasses. Poor glasses. <laughs> okay. Ah. Okay. Okay, Patty. Dile a Hermes. Okay. Um, dice que los <laughs> Hermes. Um, Ricardo tell you. Um, Ricardo said. Send. Message, I you. No, 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 Yes. Four, yes. Four, four. four. No plastic <laughs> ones because you cannot broke. <laughs> cuatro. Cuatro glasses. De vidrio. Four of them. Quiebralos. <laughs> yeah. Very good. You're broken. Yeah. Very good. Okay, guys. Do you like that activity? It was so much fun, right? 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but at the same time, it's hard. Okay, uh, where I was about to give you another speaking activity, but uh, it was no time. Oh, yeah, the time was really fast for tomorrow, Ricardo. The, today is the last day. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's why you say that. Well, tomorrow, did you come on, Ricardo? <laughs> okay, guys. Well, it was a really funny class. I was so happy. So happy that I can see you once again. Yeah, this is the last class, guys. Well, hopefully you have learned a little bit of English, right? Hopefully, yeah. And hope, yeah, I wish I could be with you, but I don't know. That depends on my boss. Uh, but I wish you a great, great vacation in the meantime, okay? A mm. nice, nice weekend. Please take care, okay? Because I want to see you once again. If I'm be with you, that would be nice. But if you're going to be with somebody else, you're going to learn a lot, okay? So please continue like the way you have been right now. Continue studying, do your exercises. Ask, okay? Ask when you have a doubt. That's what we're here for, to help you. And I don't know if you have, if you need any comments, any positive or negatives, the microphone is yours. Anybody wants to speak? No? Thank you, you teacher, teacher, for your help. For all. Thank you, teacher, for your help in this course. You're a dynamic teacher. I, this is very important for learn to speak and write and read English. <laughs> I do really appreciate your comment. Thank you. I'm trying to do my best because I know that being at 9 p.m. and right every day, after long hours of working, it's not easy. It's not easy. But I'm so happy that you show your commitment, your commitment to be here every single night. I'm so happy every time that I see you, okay? Because I know that you're tired, but you're here. And that's what makes me happy. Because you want to learn and you put your effort. You go straight ahead, you go an extra mile and that's what it is. And that it reflects, right? In your progress think about it think about the first time that you were in English class and think about today do you have improved your English is much better your writing your pronunciation is it improving okay very good you see 10% teacher 90% student ah, teacher. thank you teacher <laughs> my pleasure thank Maria you, Luisa. For time. Thank you. my pleasure Patty my pleasure Anybody else who wants to kill me? Okay, <laughs> this is a great moment. <laughs> thank, thank you. Thank you, teacher, for thank helping you. us, for supporting us, for being special with us. Thank wow. you for you're, all. You're going to make me cry. So I, thank you so much. I try to do my best because, as I said, you are my English babies. Okay? It's a great teacher. Thank you so much, Patty. Okay, so I, I know that you have to eat because you're angry. <laughs> oh, thank you. You're going to broke my heart, Wilfredo. And you're going to make my husband jealous. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, no. I'm just kidding. Okay, I'm teasing you. All righty. I wish you the best, no. guys. Okay, have hugs and kisses. And hopefully I can see you next time, okay? Bye bye. Bye bye. Say hi to Carlitos. Thank you.